when Diana says that she feels like she can't really get close to you, what are you thinking? Okay. <laughs> get out your feelings and get into your bag. Can I just say something? I feel like out of all the women here, you're the most guarded one. Like, how did we get from liability to lawyers to me? That's where it started, no? No. You what do you want to know, Diana? <laughs> what are we doing? I really, really like you, but I feel like for your friendship, I had to work extra hard and I got nowhere. Do you hear her? Do you hear where she's coming from? <laughs> Just for a second. What do you hear? What do you hear her say? <laughs> I think she's I think she's sad and in pain about whatever happened between you two. I just like to know you better differently. You know, I would like to know you better yeah, differently so, as well, Diana. That's what I'm saying. Diana Jenkins joined you ladies this season, but Sutton, you didn't get off on quite the right foot. I'm a very good friend. To whom? I am loyal to the end. So you say. That I know. So you say. That, that I know. So you say? That I know. So you say? Is it that serious? Okay. She comes to your birthday party and she's all dolled up. Yeah. And with matching fur coats with her husband. And I said something, maybe, that I shouldn't have said because I was protecting you, I think, maybe. And I said, oh, that was a really short bed rest. I just wanted to talk to you first. Check on you. I'm good. See how you're doing. Because you were on bed rest. I still am, but it's all good. So you're on bed rest, but you're here. Yeah. So that's confusing. I realized she got hurt by that. You are the fakest person I've ever met in my life, literally. By the way, also, you're boring. I can forgive everything. I can't forgive being boring. I think that Diana came into the group wanting to not like me. Mm. Because one of the first times we were all together, she said I was clumsy with my words. She's clumsy with her words and her behavior. Yep. How do you know that I'm clumsy with my words? We haven't had a conversation yet. So actually, I'm quite smart and not clumsy with my words. True T, bitch. How do you know that I'm clumsy with my words? Who told you that? Who do you think told her? There's two people that she knows. It's either Lisa. Cheers. I really do love always having our- always say that. I do. <laughs> why? I know, everybody's like, why? I'm like, because I like her. Mm. Mm. I know, people think I'm such a f***ing bitch. I didn't mean to hurt you or Harry when I spoke of something in public, and that's something that I don't normally do, and that was my mistake. I'm sorry. I appreciate you saying you're sorry. I, I do. But you didn't buy a tape. So let's just be clear about that. Do you want to do this? Do you? I thought you have a receipt for the tip for the table. Did you bring them? Lisa, come on. Don't do this to me. I don't want to hear this mess. Don't do it. Don't do it. Well, you brought it up that it was canceled, though. So she's proving that it's not. Amazing grace, how sweet the sound. I just sang at your funeral. It's over for y'all. You know, I don't want to hold this. I don't want to carry it. There are times where you are infuriating and it makes me mad when I think about it. And I want to okay. frickin' strangle you, so I will be honest about that. Get the fuck up out of here with that bullshit! Get off the motherfucking mic! It's kind of fun for me to, like, torture you. <laughs> to add? Okay. No, 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 no. Let's take it back. Uh-huh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right here. Right here. This is a problem. I don't want to have this with you anymore. Now listen. I can't do this anymore. 
That was f***ing mean. No, it wasn't. Yes, it was. Don't play dumb. It's aggressive. Let her talk. Let her talk. I don't Let care if I'm aggressive. I'm not having you your back right now, and I'm not having and her you back. You never had my back. Have your own f***ing back, Sutton Strack. I have never seen Erica really just let loose and just have fun. And it's nice and it's refreshing. And you also see someone who is trying to have a moment where they can smile, you know, and, and maybe get out of their own life for a hot second. Right. And I, I have a drinking problem. <laughs> oh, <laughs> <laughs> well, we can get to that one later. Oh. Oh. Ma'am. Do you have a drinking problem? No, I don't have a drinking problem. Neither do I, but you tried to push it. What was our holiday party? I don't really remember. I wouldn't think you would. Our girl was faced. I mean, yeah. you were slurring your words. Did you black out when you got home? Yeah, I hit my head. <sighs> now with Claire, there actually is something going on. I think what Erica's saying is she'd just rather her say it to her face instead of talking behind her back. Are you trying to get over or are you trying to be helpful? But then Garcelle came in with that that good comeback. But is that to make Erica look bad or is that out of genuine Erica, concern? I don't have to make you look bad. You can do that on your own. I was, I was shook. <laughs> hey, look, that's a cute little quick read. I get it. But she still didn't answer the question. I asked her, hey, are you looking out for me or is this, are you being judgmental? You know, you can do that all on your own, which is a pure, you know, put it back on you. Mm. You know, I feel like she's judgmental, and I don't understand why, because she's gone through some things in her life that perhaps she should actually understand, I think, where I'm coming from. You really were concerned. Yeah. I was being the... Mm. Did you think it was an act? It wasn't an act. I, I couldn't decide. Yeah. But you were truly concerned. You really were. Yeah. I think that there is concern but I think that it was retaliation for how she treated Jax. I mean, my birthday party was a bit out of control. She hit on my older son, and then she cursed at my younger son. It was like a freak show, honestly. Mexico, I mean... Falling out of the sleigh. Falling in a sleigh. I, I mean, I think all those things. When does that cross a line? When do we go, oh, you know what? We should probably look out for her. This has happened once too many. I can't breathe. Uh, without someone criticizing what I do right now. I remember talking about Crystal and her eating disorder, and I had asked her if she had ever sought professional help, and she said no. You know, because she talks a lot about having an eating disorder and what it does to young women, and, you know, she's brought it up. Yeah. I'm just bringing that to the table. Thank you. You're Thank welcome. you for saying You're that. not feeling good about that? Yeah, it's okay. You know, the holidays are weird. There's a lot of food. It's a lot of food. Oh. It's just the holidays, like, I've been going out every night, and there's just like, just more food. Yeah. Like you said, more food. Like, yeah. It's normal. But does In that summer, trigger you, or how do you feel? Yeah. Do you know? Oh, you look okay. beautiful. Maybe really ignorant for a second. Really beautiful. Is it like you eat it and feel guilty, or you deny yourself eating it? I'm just curious. You out of order. You out of order. I always, I okay. Well, I always think take laxatives and get rid of it. <laughs> wow. <laughs> so what happens when you purge? I just feel better. It's like a relief. Right. Because before... Is it because it's out? Yeah. Now all of a sudden, it's the other way. Now I need to be corralled and, oh my God, what's happening? So I went from zero to a thousand. Yeah. And I'm okay with it. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Everyone else can have a good time. You know, I can't lay down because clearly something bad's happening. And I, I thought about that. And I also thought, you know what? Your husband, you... Kyle, Mauricio, Lisa, Harry, the people that I'm the closest with, no one is concerned. And Diana has been very sweet as well. To come in and just be like, Erica, don't worry about it. I get it. Yes. And I appreciate that because they know. They know the hell I'm walking through. And they're like, cut this chick a break. It's really important to point out, we're talking about out of thousands of times, you could 
count on one hand and still have fingers left over. Yeah. At that point, when you're asked, do you think that there's a problem? My initial thought is, uh, well, hell <laughs> I not. wish there was. <laughs> So when we were all sitting around after Melissa's performance, somebody said, is there anything else that we need to share with the group? And I said, yep, I've got something that I want to talk about. And it's something about friends with liabilities. I did get called by an attorney. I don't know who contacted her. I don't know anything other than what was said at Dorit's fundraiser. I do know this, and I said this from the very beginning. Do not talk about this. The more all of you talk about this, the more people who are on the peripheral will come to you. Here's the thing. You know, Erica's saying if Sutton hadn't said anything and kept her mouth shut, she would never have gotten herself involved in this whole thing. All of us here have known Erica longer and yet none of us were contacted by any lawyers. So I'm thinking, I think Erica's probably right. Maybe she was alluding to the fact that she knew more than she did or something last year. And that's why they're reaching out to her because none of us have been contacted. It makes no sense. A subpoena, a deposition. It wasn't, it what, wasn't what, a subpoena yet because I hired a litigator to answer questions. Serve that hoe. Slaughter her. You feel that because they targeted you and came after you and nobody else right, in no this one group else. is because you were the only one I have no that idea. was questioning Erica. She well, wasn't she the only one. Because when you're in a legal situation like that, every word counts. We're not even sure that there were people that weren't paid. What? You what? So you're saying that we don't know for a fact that these people weren't paid? These That's victims? right, exactly right. You mean that there's a chance there's that a they chance. can be lying? Somebody ain't doing the math right. You are a liability no, and not me. Here's the oh, IAR oh, and there it is. I, I told it. you to be quiet. No, you didn't. <laughs> Bitch, <laughs> shut up. Did you ask him if he stole Andy, from these people? Andy, he doesn't even acknowledge Anything. Everybody just wants to camera? know if she had any uh, any insight of what was going on. Why don't you on. drop the camera? Okay? Do you hear me? Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, he's, he wants to answer the question. No, he doesn't. I think she does. Let's, let's go. Thank you, Tom. Truth tea, bitch.